I'm nervous. <laughs> Today we are going to go do the advanced open water paddy scuba cert, or we're going to start it, scuba cert off of our boat with some of our friends who happen to be paddy instructors. So um, it's going to be cool being able to do scuba off our boat. We're also kind of, you know, this will be a good refresher for us in general because we haven't done as much as we'd like to, but it's something we want to do a lot more of in the future because why not? You live on a boat and go to tropical places, so you should be able to do this. Yes. We got certified in Hawaii in 2012, and we went four years later in the Great Barrier Reef in Australia. So this is about so, so we're three due. or four years <laughs> later again. <laughs> so today will be an interesting day. Two hour motor out, uh, we're taking Honu, and then there's mooring balls out there. Uh, Neptune Reef is where we're going, and then I enjoy our time, and two hours back. Should be easy day, zero wind today, water's glassy, really clear conditions. So uh, it's really ideal for what we're doing. So let's get the engines on, get moving. How did the shark decide between two items? He chose wisely. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> did you make that up? <laughs> yeah. Uh, I told you guys these get worse. <laughs> It's a beautiful day and very clear water and you can see all these fish around our boat and I'm really glad we're scuba diving today. The last time I went scuba diving was at the Great Barrier Reef. I've never been scuba diving in the United States so this would be pretty cool. Oh. <laughs> you get to do it from the boat we from live on. Honu. <laughs> All right, Ryan is doing his test now. <laughs> so we just did a bunch of talking and quizzing and stuff like that, and now it's gonna get real. We're getting ready to rig up and go in. So I'm excited. So this is Shelby and Brad. Shelby is a dive instructor. Brad's also a dive instructor. And they are teaching us and basically holding our hands, probably literally today, so. All right, so we're working on our skills because we really want to see these sharks that are 90 feet deep, I guess. Not right? today. It's not today. And another, on another we day. We got to prep for it. So this is why we are doing this today. I'm nervous. <laughs> we have to take off our mask and then put it back on and get the water out, and that's the part I hate. <laughs> And the cold, but you'll get used to that. I always have more fun when I'm at the bottom after I do it for a while and I look at fish and stuff, but when I first get in, I'm like nervous and shaking from the cold and being nervous. So. How do you feel, man? I'm, I'm chill, I'm excited. I just wanna make sure my equalization's okay because I had a bad time with that. So Show your dive time allowance, your depth, um, and the time remaining for the dive. This is going to be your air. What's SPG stand for? Uh, submersible pressure gauge. Okay. <laughs> tastes like air, doesn't taste funky, and it orally like. So we got a couple other divers out today, which is pretty rad. There's a few other boats out hanging out. I think that makes Jessica and Ryan feel a little more comfortable. Babysitting 101 check-in. Hi, Kira. Okay without doing it. The pressure inflator there, you don't have to do it orally, but add little burst of air to zero. Which the numbers show here, but then you're kicking out like this, or you can look on the top. I prefer looking on the top. Looking good, Jess. So high. Can you get me up? You got big old feet, girl. One small step for Shelby. <laughs> One big step. For Shelby. For Shelby. <laughs> looking good, Jay. Uh, I'm stuck. <laughs> Jesse, watch. Oh. Got it, we're showing. Hey!
Who is that in the water, Kira? <laughs> Who's in the water? Aria, who are you looking for? Nice. High five. <laughs> Kira, are you going to go for a scuba uh, dive? Where she's going to. If not, perhaps we'll get the GoPro in. Yeah. I just want to go before Light goes down. We got to go. Hi, uh, oh, Kira. You can be a master diver, unlike me. <laughs> Awesome. Super so proud. proud. <laughs> Sunset dive. Good land. <laughs> Love you, Mom. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. So, I didn't really do any of the skills except hovering at the bottom. Um, I was just too nervous and I was like, I can't worry about being under the water and doing skills when I'm stressed out. So I just went and just spent time in the water and looked at the sights and the fishes. So maybe next time I'll do the skills, but for now I'm just doing what I'm comfortable with and getting used to it again. So, that's all I'm doing. Yeah. So I'm gonna let Kelsey get in the water and um, take the rest of the sunlight to go see the sights down there. And just a scaredy cat. Ryan did all the skills and now he's um, filming with the GoPro for you guys. So you'll see that. I'm excited to show you guys. I didn't get to film, but he will. And thank you, Shelby and Brad. Sorry I couldn't do all the skills today, too nervous, but thank you for being patient and taking me out for a good time. <laughs> time and they're still in the water <laughs> so I'm glad I didn't go on the second dive because then I would be really freaked out. How was it? Cool! <laughs> we saw a lot of cool stuff down there. It was cool like it got it got dark on us. It was super cool so my skills portion ended up going into the dark so one of the things you can do for an advanced open water is also night dive. I don't know what we did the skills for a night dive but it was kind of a cool precursor. So yeah, it's like a whole reef. And it's not a reef, it's like structures. And it was in the dark, we had a light. So I guess, I think I got some good footage on that one show. Uh, some fish and stuff. It was cool, got a little, a lot of skills practiced and, and, and done today. And overall, I, it just gave me more confidence. So that was good. Yeah. Definitely tired. We have a two hour ride back to the mooring ball, but a successful day, learned a lot. It was fun, it was beautiful. I don't really think I could have asked for anything more. Nothing bad, nothing bad happened and that's the number one goal, right? So definitely need to get into this more. It's something we enjoy every single time we do and we just don't do it enough. So dive gear will be on the wish list. Well, we gotta go. So thanks for watching this video and we'll see you in the next one. Cheers guys. It's terrible. Woo!